Frank Summer and her mother were at the best place around. In the sky, smoke on the water. No idea what the name of this program is, but you're watching it. Backstage. All you ever want. Backstage. All you ever need. Backstage. Your dreams will be fulfilled once you are there. You'll never want to leave. You want to sell your ass for that backstage pass. Hi darlings, uh, here we are in another car video and this time we're going to the train station to go to Budapest. I'm going to have a reading show there and promotion and press and whatever for the Hungarian version, um, which is also out. And this time I am accompanied by no, God, this, this, this young gentleman. Hello, Benjamin. What are you expecting? A very good show, obviously. Back to you. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, so I'm looking forward. Um, and um, it's funny that there is a Hungarian version. And so we'll keep you posted from our Budapest adventure. Hello. 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 Hi, Benny. Hi, Bobo. This time it's not a car video, it's a train video. Yeah. Where are we going? Uh, we're going to Budapest Keleti because we have a show tomorrow with the Hungarian version of the book. And we are very excited and looking forward to the show. Yeah. Well, this is my executive producer, bodyguard and cameraman, soon to be manager, Benjamin Leon Dolezai. Love and respect. Hello darlings, we are here in the train to Budapest um, tomorrow, uh, Saturday, I'm going to have a reading show for the first time English-Hungarian, this would be nice because the Hungarian edition of my book is now out and also sells nicely um, and very good and to say you know because people in, from the Spanish edition were writing to me uh, you know when the Spanish edition this is part of the local publishers in Spain in France etc we have 
German, we have English, we have Italian and we have Hungary because they were fast. Uh, the others need some more time. Uh, you get updates on my website uh, buddhisworld.com and I say looking forward to uh, Budapest. Don't forget the history of Budapest and Queen 1986 where I was privileged to film them in the NEP stadium in Budapest which was the first concert in the Eastern world from a big international rock star band. Hello darlings, we are here in Budapest Keleti, the main train station, and we have no idea what we can expect. Um, our publishing house organized a reading show and meeting with fans and signing session and television, radio, blah blah blah. And um, I'm going to look forward. I love Budapest because I was here with Queen in 1986 and also afterwards did a image film for Budapest in Vienna. So I know a little bit, of course, it was a long time ago, but I'm looking forward. And um, so far in the preparations, there were very nice people in Budapest for organizing this. And in general, Hungarians are very okay. Yeah, darlings, we are here at yes. the wonderful uh -huh. Budapest. Keleti. Uh, Galaxy, uh, uh, a train station. train station, yes. And I remembered uh, 1990 yes. or 89, after Queen played in Budapest, yes, uh -huh. I was doing a city portrait, city portrait. On, on Budapest and compared it to Vienna. So this is a great memory. 2005, no? Huh? Please pull on just concept. Uh, 2005, yeah. I think it was 2006. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, yeah, yes, I was yes, here. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes, uh, and I filmed Magic Years. Yes, Magic Years. Yes, yes. 
<laughs> you are part of the Hungarian fan club? Yes, 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 yes. Tell me a little bit, what are we going to do tomorrow? Oh, yes, 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 maybe, uh, maybe a lot of people. Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Good, Hungarian Queen fans, tomorrow, 7, uh, no, 5 p.m. 5 p.m. At? At uh, Magnet House. Okay. Magnet Közösségi Ház. Talking Hungarian. Hungarian. Mag Magnet Közösségi Ház, Andrási út 98, délután 5-től, este 8-ig. Gyertek! <laughs> okay. Here we arrived. Ja, hallo Benjamin, wir sind nach ähm, Budapest gekommen, um eine Lesung zu machen, aber du machst hier was anderes. Wir essen. Du Na isst. Nahrungsaufnahme ist wichtig. Also, ja, mal ernst, die Freunde von die ungarischen Freunden. Ah, jetzt habe ich dich erwischt. Now I got you. You stole one of my fries. So, this is not what is this? Uh, Patatas. Uh, Hungarian. Hungarian, I don't know. And what is this? Ali olio. This? Pollo. And I thought we came here to Budapest to make a show. Yes. Okay, But the show is tomorrow to the yes. We have to eat the Hello. <laughs> Hello. What's your name? I don't want pictures. Can you say something in Hungarian? No, it's okay. Oh. okay. So we can photo. Hi darlings, um, <clears throat> I'm here in a hotel in Budapest and uh, we are gonna have a great show tonight um, together with the Hungarian publisher of my book, my friend Freddy, Balaton, Baraton Freddy, I think, excuse my Hungarian. I'm gonna do this uh, in English, the reading, and a uh, interpreter will interpret also, of course, with music and uh, A signing session, which is got probably gonna be uh, after midnight, because I'm use I'm always signing every book that people buy or bring to my readings of my book. So, if you live in Hungary in Budapest and you still have no plane, you can still go. I think there are a few tickets left. Um, but I'm soon gonna be also in other cities. So now we had, of course, uh, Austria and Germany, but we had Rome. We had Spain, we had the Canary, we had the two of the Canarias, now we have Budapest, and there's more coming up. Mwah! The world tour. Hello darlings, um, I am in Budapest with my dear friend, and they're talking down here in Hungarian, I don't understand the word. Um, it's interesting. We know when you're on tour, and we did now Spain and Rome and Germany, Austria, Budapest, every country is different. I love Hungary, I love my experiences here with Queen, and on top of everything, Benjamin is doing a documentary, Rudy in Budapest, will be, which will be soon on my YouTube channel. Tonight, uh, as always, there is this um, reading show which I make very, very personal and with a Q&A. So everything you want to know about Freddie Mercury or Queen, which I know, I don't know everything, um, please come and ask the questions. And in general, Freddie forever. Will be fulfilled once you are there, you never wanna leave. Hello, hello everybody, I'm Giovanni from uh, Frica Comics in Budapest. We are uh, publishing the uh, book of uh, Rudy Dolezal, it's uh, my friend Freddy, Freddy Borato. Uh, and uh, today we have the presentation in the Magnet House uh, in uh, Budapest, in Andrashi Ut. And we are waiting for you all. So come and we will have a very, very good night together. Uh, jó napot mindenkinek, uh, Giovanni vagyok, Frike Comics-ból, uh, itt vagyunk a Rudival, megyünk a Magnetászba, és itt ma, ma este lesz a bemutató, Queen bemutató, Freddy barátom a könyve, a Rudy Dollarral írt könyvet, és várunk mindenkit szeretettel. Sziasztok!
Ferencváros Budapest oder Honvéd? <lacht> Ferencváros. <lacht> Hi darlings, um, only two hours to show time. Hello. Hello, hello, Rudy. Hello, Rudy. Hello. Uh, Budapest Queen, uh, uh, Queen fan, fan club fans. Uh, yeah. Yes. And uh, we're gonna do the presentation of the Hungarian edition. And um, they're all very, very um, enthusiastic. And I hope that we have a really nice presentation. And I'm, of course, gonna read parts of my bestseller, which now is also out in Hungarian. <laughs> Ferenc Varos. Yes, you heard that photo. Photo? Yeah. Yeah. This is my picture in the table in Fan Club. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is some of the guys. Oops. Ma my. Yeah. Wow. Original, but oh, if you frame it, yes. it will. Okay, this is a great moment on stage. Budapest, 1986, and I had the privilege to film Magic Years and film in Budapest. John Deacon. Laszlo Hegedus. Laszlo Hegedus? Yes. The famous who organized. He is actually a very nice person. Budapest Nap Stadium at the time. Now it looks different, right? Yes, yes, yes. yes. It is also it will be able to I mean, a new stadium. Okay. But the place is the same. And everyone calls it Nap Stadium. Anyway. Okay. Nice. <laughs> this is Spike Edney in the back with our beloved Queen member and one of the bodyguards. It's not, I don't think it's stage, it's the other one. Yeah, well, 86, I mean, we look quite different. <laughs> and Queen looked quite different. Okay, so this was a little history tour into the 86 adventure of uh, Queen in Budapest, which is why, uh, can you give me a Hungarian book? A Hungarian, the other one, which is black and white. This is why, uh, you know, um, um, I published, or a publisher published the Hungarian version, because Budapest and Queen have a really interesting history together. Uh, they also came back with Paul Rogers. I was also privileged to film that. <clears throat> so this is now already history, and it's all done by fans. If you give me the, yeah, it's all done by those people. What? Queen forever. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> and this is the picture. Thank you very, very much. Thank you very much. It's very nice. Can I put it can I put it online? Yeah? Yeah, you have to write me down your name. Write it here, but in big, big letters. Yeah, because then I can say in the internet that you are the artist, you know? No, no. no. My name? Yeah? 
Don't be excited. Can you write me your phone number if I need something? No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. From the single man. Sorry. This. this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but the other. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. <laughs> For Nora. Yeah. Here's your book. Here's your book. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Action. So, Rudy, you know, my favorite Queen video was always One Vision. Uh, I was 11 back in 1986 when the Hungarian TV was happy to show a few Queen videos before the concert, just uh, behind the Iron Curtain, which was very rare to see promotional videos of Western rock bands. But Queen hit through the wall, of course, as a promotional, uh, a promotional thing before the concert. And I was, when I first saw, as an 11-year-old boy, I saw this video and I was hooked on Queen. And ever since, this is my favorite ever promotional video. I think it's a masterpiece. It shows the energy of the band and your work, the editing and everything done in the small budget, but uh, uh, in a small uh, studio of Queen without any gimmicks and everything else. I, I, up to this day, I still feel it's the best video of Queen and I'm really happy to rewatch it over and over again. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you for the compliment. First time you are announcing your own father, do you know already what you're gonna say here in Budapest? Of course, yes. I was tortured to to know what I have to say. It is Emperor in eingebrannt. We would say in German. Yeah, of course, uh, it is eingebrannt in my uh, memory. So um, yeah. But you're not telling us yet. No. It's, okay. a, it's a secret. Obviously. Until the performance. Okay. Congratulations that you have a new job. <laughs> Freddy super group with Rod Stewart and Elton John. A következő uh, fejezet, tehát fog, ha és bor, ez a cím, ez a 12. fejezet, Freddy super group, Rod Stewart és Elton John. I once had the privilege of being invited to a very special private dinner at Freddy Mercury's house, Garden Lodge. A dinner is what English people like to call dinner party. Uh, but you mustn't think that this is a party in the true sense of the world. It's basically a dinner where you chat and where the host has come up with a multi-course menu. That night, Frey had not only done that, but also had labeled little cards with names and draw up a plan where who has to sit where. As usual, uh, everything was thought through, and so I was sitting in the middle between Elton John and Rod Stewart. Nobody applauds, or when I do a great video, nobody says, Rudy, Rudy, so you cannot give me enough applause tonight. I was a very good person who 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 was a very good
Good enough. Satisfaction, you can do what the hell you please. I was asked at the time, I think it was in the 80s of the last century, <laughs> a little joke, uh, to do the official image film for the World Exhibition Expo, uh, which 1990 was meant to happen parallel in Vienna as a Western state and in Budapest as part of the Eastern Bloc. Um, and there was always one film at the beginning to announce it, and I did that. So I was filming here in Budapest about two weeks, Vienna Deto. And then the world exhibition was called off because 1989 uh, the wall came down and there was no reason to build bridges because it was all one euro. Now, this place behind me, we are still on the place of uh, the heroes. We did a lot of different things in this Vienna Budapest film, which was called Expo 90. You can see it on uh, my YouTube channel, with it already says Global TV. Because up here, uh, you know where the horses are in this uh, fighter, we were moving a model with very strange outfit from a Hungarian designer with a crane up there, and she was standing next to this figure up there. Yeah, physically. We also filmed, uh, uh, and I, when they asked, you know, do you want to come up and see? I unfortunately said yes, because I don't know how many meters it are, are but it's too much for me. I was standing up there and I was all, almost peeing in my pants. So this is one of the many memories I have with Budapest. And of course, a few years earlier, I was privileged to film the famous Queen in Budapest. Uh, for my series Magic Years. Stay tuned, there will be more from Budapest soon. Budapest and Queen have a very long and interesting relationship. Satisfaction you can do what the hell you please Yeah, because I see in the background this balloon of course I remember how Brian from the backstage area was doing a balloon uh, how do you say travel and everybody was very nervous nervous and uh, it's in the movie so check it out all you ever want all you ever need your dreams will be fulfilled once you are there you never want to leave backstage it's where you get the action Satisfaction you can do what the hell you please
<clears throat> yeah, darlings, this was the bridge that we couldn't pass when I filmed the Budapest documentary, um, Expo 90, because there was a strike of the taxi drivers. So Buda and Pest, as you might know, are two parts of one and the same city, Budapest. But they are connected through a bridge and the Danube goes in between them. So it was kind of a challenge. Yeah, the movie you, by the way, can watch on my YouTube channel, Rudi Dolitzer's Dorothy. Stay tuned. Satisfaction you can do what the hell you please What is this called? What are you doing? Yeah, sorry. No. Enjoy. Enjoy. Huh? Enjoy. No, Enjoy. thank you. Uh, yeah, this is fun. Yeah. Holy taxi. Yeah, you see. Under the castle now. The castle is up here. You see, also you can go by this uh, cabin. Like a lift. Oh. Yeah, very nice. You see many people waiting because they go by this lift. Lazy. Yeah. <laughs> So no access here, you see, mm -hmm. bridge also, maybe you can see the old uh, Intercontinental Hotel on the other side. Mm -hmm. The first district of Budapest. Mm. First, because Castle District is oh. the number one. Oh, start again. again. You know, when Freddy was on the boat uh, on the Danube and he showed the parliament, yeah. and he told that how many bedrooms are inside or can I buy yeah, yeah. this one? Yes, this is. I remember. Yeah, I remember. remember. The yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Magic gear. Sziasztok mindenkinek, itt vagyunk a vonaton, Rudi már indul Bécs felé. Nagyon jó volt vele találkozni, itt voltunk három napig, volt egy nagy esemény szombaton, a Magnetházban, és nagyon, nagyon mindenki nagyon örült hozzá, nagyon sok ember jött, és hát mindenki vár újra, hogy visszajön Rudi, és remélem, hogy nem sokára újra találkozunk. Köszönöm szépen!
I'm so thankful that I speak Hungarian fluently, so I understood <laughs> everything he said. Thank you, Giovanni. He is my publisher of the Hungarian version. And thank you, Andrew. Thank you very much. See us talk. Thank you very much. Thank yeah. you, Rudy. Thank you, and bye bye. You want to know what goes on backstage? Oh, come on. Let me take you by the hand. Ow! Rudy, are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen! The way I see it, Barry, this should be a very dynamite show. You know, I have no idea what the name of this program is, but you're watching it. Backstage. All you ever want Backstage All you ever need Backstage Your dreams will be fulfilled once you are there You'll never want to leave you want to sell your ass For that backstage pass Backstage It's just for the invited Backstage Will be fulfilled once you are there.